Are you like daddy's new car? Yeah. Is it a hot rod? Yeah. Is it a race car? Yeah. Is your daddy cool now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Finally, it took him forever. So I made the trip down here on a Sunday afternoon to see my son's new ride. Look at that, boy. It's his first legitimate hot rod. And uh, here he is. And it's already broke. Oh, yeah, it's already <laughs> broke in true hot rod fashion. Yep. We're going to put a new alternator on it today. So this is going to be my first time seeing this beast of an engine so let's let's do this man let's check it out it's a 87 trans am yep the engine's a 57 so we got a we got a three fit oh yeah nice and clean in there check too. that out boy that's pretty ac card that's nice tune port injection and that's the problem right there yep. the old alternator and they got these things crammed in here so we're going to grab some tools out of his massive toolkit down there <laughs> and uh, we're going to get wrenching on this thing. We've already got the alternator, so let's get to it. Nice set of ratcheting wrenches will be a nice yeah. investment too. Oh, Mm. Hold on. Oh, goodness gracious. Busted knuckles. Mm. Oh, man. You're freaking. Let me give a shot. That just, I got it loose for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give it a shot. Oh, good. I don't know, you used a different one. <laughs> Leverage, <Yeah>. baby. <laughs> Leverage. Duh. What an idiot. That's me. <laughs> leverage that's called wisdom right there <laughs> yeah that is wisdom <laughs> work smart not hard <laughs> work smart not hard <laughs> okay now i'll let you put this on yeah episode two of this is going to be us going and getting him some real tools Long overdue. Yes. But he's my father, so I blame him. Yeah. Blame me all you want. So the last time I think we were both under the hood of a car at the same time was when we were working on the race car that he had. I don't know if he's talked oh, about yeah. his race cars. I have not. But uh, yeah, Bearfield Speedway. Then built one, bought the car for how much? Uh, I think I paid 300 50 bucks for it i remember 80 dollars. oh yeah yeah it was you're right it was 80 bucks yeah and it had uh the head gasket was was blown on his was little that? chevy okay. cavalier yeah and so i had the head <laughs> took the head and had it decked uh which is smoothed out and then put a new uh put a new head gasket on it ran the piss out of that thing then he tuned it up and that thing was going around the track like a like a a little four wheel front wheel drive little rocket that as much awesome. as a cavalier could go yeah i mean it was fun <laughs> it was we had it we had it uh i mean with a little short short track like that this little front wheel drive class the first year it was ever ever a thing yeah and uh remember we used to i used to get my butt kicked by a a station wagon oh yeah my buddy had a station wagon and that thing it had a v6 he would just kill us all in it he, yeah it, it was just Murder. that thing was and then i remember somebody came out with a 
he had a Saturn. Oh yeah, he had a little five-speed Saturn something, which is basically plastic. Yeah, plastic car, <laughs> and he was just he was just murdering all of us. But it was really fun. My little Cavalier, it was the one that looked like a legit race car. I had all the numbers, and I had actual decals on it. You had sponsorships? Yeah, I had sponsorships, and uh, so I basically got free tires and and uh, from the local junkyard. And uh, man, that was so much fun. And yeah. then what did what did we you, what did I bought something else? It's a, it was a Pontiac. Uh, was it was it Bonneville? No, was it Bonneville? It might have been a Bonneville that. Yeah. That I and then I let I let you drive the the Cavalier. He let his fourteen year old son <laughs> <laughs> drive I'll, I'll a race a, car. <laughs> I'll put a picture in here, like right now. I'll yeah. put a picture in of both of us uh, standing side by side in our race suits. That was that was some fun. Yeah. Me and my son out there uh, racing together, and uh, man, that was I blew the I blew the Pontiac up <laughs> like the very first the very first race. I got yeah. one race out of it, blew it up, and uh, that was it for that. But it that one looked pretty cool too mm -hmm. but that was that was some good times man yeah. we that, that was that was, that was great i hold it over his head that uh yeah i'm 14 and i i utilized the the car that he had been dialing in and i was helping him but you know most of it was him uh and then i raced it i qualified fifth finished fifth in the race and i beat him yeah I pulled up. Just lined up right there. Look pretty close. Where does it need to butt up right up against that? Uh, that's right that's there. pretty good. Yeah, that's where it goes to. As long as you don't leak out the sides, don't leak in the sides. It's a race, race car. car. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. Yeah? You like Daddy's race car? Yes. Who wouldn't, huh? I do a good story. Yeah. Whose truck is that? Papa. Yeah. Get me, Piper. <laughs> Where you want to go in? Animal. Well, you got to tell Papa you want, you want to go in this truck. You want to go in my truck? Okay. Go. Whoa. I'm just right here, just drinking my. You want to get in there too, Brandon? Jump around. I'm okay. <laughs> I think I'm okay. Of it falling. <laughs> so what do you think, man? It's pretty sweet. I love how these things sit. You just feel like yeah, you're. You just feel cool. You just feel like you're going faster than you actually are. But well, in high school, two out of the three uh, really good friends of mine, best friends in high school, two of them had uh, had Camaros, and I'm sitting there with my '91 Lumina. My other buddy had like a Cavalier, but. Guys, I finally got my car. I finally got one. <laughs>
cigarettes. Is that what that's for? I don't know. But <laughs> that probably. totally makes sense. I don't know. Is. 